We're on the brink of witnessing a groundbreaking moment that will shape the future of battery cells. Tesla's new move is definitely a checkmate to all other EV makers. In a stunning and unexpected twist, Tesla has unveiled a mind-blowing new patent application for a new dry electrode lithium doping process. It's a game changer that'll rewrite the rulebook on energy density and performance. Today, we're diving deep into the nitty-gritty of this electrifying technology and get ready to be blown away by Tesla's revolutionary dry electrode patent. Now you might be wondering, what the heck is a dry electrode lithium doping process? Okay, so it's a fancy way of saying that Tesla's found a super cool way to amp up the energy density and performance of their battery cells. Tesla's dry electrode lithium doping process involves directly adding highly volatile lithium metal to its dry electrode coating process. By integrating lithium in this manner, they're literally turning up the juice. Energy density is the secret sauce in the world of electric vehicles. It's about how much energy you can cram into each unit of weight or volume. And let me tell you, the importance of energy density in electric vehicle batteries cannot be overstated. With higher energy density, electric vehicles can go the distance, say goodbye to range anxiety, and hello to longer trips on a single charge. And improved energy density also means mind-blowing acceleration and overall performance. Electric vehicles will easily zoom past the competition and leave traditional cars in the dust. So you see, Tesla's dry electrode lithium doping process is their secret weapon to make electric vehicles practical, powerful, and downright awesome. To comprehend the significance of Tesla's new patent, we have to uncover the backstory of this patent. Tesla didn't just wake up one day and decide to change the game. Oh no, this patent is actually a continuation of previous applications filed by Maxwell Technologies, a company that Tesla gobbled up. Tesla's aim in filing redundant patent applications is to secure intellectual property rights and optimize their claims for lithium doping processes. By submitting multiple applications, Tesla takes another step closer to achieving this. Maxwell Technologies filed the initial patent application back in February 2017. In October 2019, Maxwell Technologies hit the jackpot when they were granted a patent for their application. But during the interim period, Tesla swooped in and acquired Maxwell Technologies, leading to the transfer of the patent under Tesla's name in 2021. Not content with just one patent, Tesla went all in and filed a second patent application in October 2019, right after the acquisition. They were like, hold up, we want more. And guess what? Their persistence paid off when they were granted a patent in December of 2022. But the third and final application is the one that's been making waves in the Tesla community. As of now, this application has not yet been granted a patent. Now, why in the world would Tesla file multiple patent applications? It's because the patent process is a tricky game. It's like navigating through a labyrinth of legalities and bureaucracy. By filing multiple applications, Tesla's playing the system to their advantage. They're working closely with the patent office, making amendments to their claims, and doing whatever it takes to maximize the number of claims that are granted patents. Now, I wish I could spill all the juicy details about each claim within the patent applications, but alas, the specifics are kept under wraps. But one thing is crystal clear. Tesla's objective is to cover all their bases when it comes to various lithium doping methods. All right, now let's dive into the heart of the matter, the dry electrode lithium doping process. Traditionally, lithium doping processes have been as exciting as watching paint dry, but Tesla, being the trailblazers they are, decided to shake things up. While others were following the same old boring methods, Tesla decided to spice things up by directly adding highly volatile lithium metal to their dry electrode coating process. Let's break it down to fully grasp the magnitude of Tesla's groundbreaking patent. In the traditional lithium doping game, the first charge and discharge of cycle of a battery would form this snooze fest called the solid electrolyte interface. It's like a protective layer for the graphite anode, but it gobbles up precious lithium resulting in first cycle losses of around 6-7% for graphite anodes. But you see the difference with Tesla's innovation approach? They're saying, forget about those first cycle losses, we've got a trick up our sleeves. They're boldly incorporating that highly volatile lithium metal directly into their dry electrode coating process. 
With this electrifying move, Tesla aims to crank up the energy density of their battery cells. They're on a mission to minimize those first cycle losses and unleash the full potential of their batteries. One notable advantage of Tesla's dry electrode lithium doping process is its compatibility with both dry electrode and wet slurry electrode coating processes. This versatility allows Tesla to seamlessly integrate lithium-coated graphite into their existing manufacturing systems, paving the way for scalable production. So what's the process itself like? They blend carbon particles like porous carbon or graphite with lithium metal using high-tech tools like a mill or blender. Tesla's patent application reveals multiple pathways for lithium doping, and one of them is simply mind-blowing. They utilize cracks in activated carbon particles to store lithium. Through capillary action, the lithium metal is sucked into those cracks, resulting in what can only be described as lithiated carbon. The stuff of electric dreams. To keep the lithiated carbon particles stable and prevent them from going wild, Tesla employs a protective layer. They're like the superheroes of battery technology, swooping in to save the day. They add a polymer binder to create a protective coating or introduce electrolyte vapor to form a solid electrolyte interface layer over the lithium metal. This protective layer ensures that the lithium-coated graphite can be used in both dry electrode and wet slurry electrode coating processes. With their groundbreaking dry electrode process, Tesla's venturing into uncharted territories of energy density and battery performance. They're not just pushing the boundaries, they're shattering them. Moving on, Tesla's new dry electrode patent offers several advantages that set it apart from conventional methods. One of the key advantages of Tesla's dry electrode patent is its versatility. It's like a chameleon that can seamlessly adapt to both dry electrode and wet slurry electrode coating processes. This means it can slide right into Tesla's existing manufacturing systems without a hitch, making production more efficient than ever. By incorporating the dry electrode lithium doping process across their battery cell production lines, Tesla can maximize its benefits and optimize their manufacturing efficiency. Another advantage lies in the potential cost savings associated with Tesla's dry electrode patent. The enhanced energy density achieved through the dry electrode process can result in reduced material usage, including metal foils, electrolytes, and separators. While the specific cost-saving figures are not provided in the given text, it's evident that the dry electrode patent has the potential to drive down production costs. These cost advantages can contribute to making electric vehicles more accessible and competitive in the market. Say goodbye to sky-high prices and hello to affordable electric dreams. The improved energy density resulting from Tesla's dry electrode patent has significant implications for electric vehicles. With Tesla's dry electrode patent, you can go the distance without worrying about running out of juice. Also, enhanced energy density also means turbocharged performance. Tesla's taking electric vehicles to new heights, making them not just practical, but also insanely fun to drive. They're turning everyday commutes into electrifying joy rides. But the impact of Tesla's dry electrode patent doesn't stop there. Oh no, it's just the beginning. This patent isn't just a piece of paper collecting dust. It's a game changer that'll shape the entire industry. First off, let's talk about the electric vehicle industry as a whole. Thanks to Tesla's dry electrode patent, we're looking at a future where electric vehicles are more than just eco-friendly transportation options. With increased energy density and faster charging capabilities, electric cars will conquer range anxiety and go head-to-head -head with traditional combustion engines. But that's not all. Tesla's patents grant them a remarkable competitive edge, establishing them as leaders in battery technology advancements. Their intellectual property and innovative technologies pave the way for further innovation, solidifying their dominance in the electric vehicle world. Competitors are left scrambling to catch up, drawing inspiration from Tesla's groundbreaking achievements because Tesla's dry electrode patent doesn't just benefit their own vehicles, it sets a roadmap for the entire industry. Other manufacturers seeking to enhance the energy density of their battery cells look to Tesla's patent as a guiding light. The knowledge gained from Tesla's groundbreaking developments propel the industry forward, pushing competitors to elevate their battery technologies and accelerate the widespread adoption of electric vehicles. Also, the potential cost savings resulting from Tesla's dry electrode process are colossal. By optimizing production processes and reducing material usage, electric vehicles become more affordable and accessible to a broader consumer base. It's an opportunity to drive the mass adoption of sustainable transportation 
and create a greener future for all. Overall, Tesla's new dry electrode patent marks a groundbreaking development in the field of lithium doping processes. By directly incorporating highly volatile lithium metal into their dry electrode coating process, Tesla has the potential to significantly enhance the energy density and performance of their battery cells. This patent not only signifies a major breakthrough for Tesla, but also holds immense promise for the electric vehicle industry as a whole. With Tesla's revolutionary dry electrode patent, the future of electric vehicles looks brighter than ever. As for other hidden gems, Tesla's always been known for its surprises and cutting-edge advancements. They have a knack for unveiling groundbreaking features and technologies that leave us in awe. Who knows what other innovations they have up their sleeves? Regarding the active carbon used in the process, it's true that it's usually organic in origin. Tesla, being a forward-thinking company, recognizes the importance of securing a sustainable and reliable supply chain. While we don't have specific information on a Swedish company, Tesla's been proactive in seeking partnerships and agreements with various suppliers to ensure access to high-quality materials, including graphite. In their quest for sustainable transportation, Tesla is likely exploring options that align with their mission of reducing carbon emissions. Whether it's through partnerships, agreements, or in-house developments, Tesla is continuously working to optimize their battery technology and contribute to a greener future. Thanks for watching. Until next time.